Jelle damra so dramatisch wie <laughs> so. Rafael en Pele. Why? What what what's the drama about? Hm? Da e. Da ra an. Ne wil je je ons andere zet ik hoor. Jelle is aan. Ik hoor jelle. Ik hoor jelle. Ah ne wil. Hm? Ons moet die gevoel gee die sensation. Sensation do. Hm? So. <laughs> These are the two guys <coughs> who years ago went because they had a show in Grootfontein. Mm-hmm. They stopped at the service station in Ochevarongo and people saw them there. Right. Oh, it's a. Who legally? Pandu Angela, ne, on set a show in Grootfontein. Yeah. No, can you let net go net? Ons gaan net hier over to any two net go net. Dat was in net, maar bam man, mag net van een gedraai. So they went into the locatie. Oh my mm. god, man. And they started drinking there. <laughs> started. Oh my god, man. Performing there. Right. Nee, kak, ons er niet meer groot van dit toe Ah. You're kidding me, so they dropped the show in Grootfontein <laughs> and yes. carried on catering in Ochivarongo. Look, yes, those never, people must have been upset. Ne- never ask us to go make a try. As a, it's chill what the problem is. Once it's all part of our work, then you have to go make a try by me. Let's see. You can say that we are catering. Yeah. We are catering. We are going to go make a try. Make a Net so. Ons draai. Kom as in. Kom as in. O tap as in. Net go goed draai maar. Mm-hmm. Kaufi maak jy ook draai. Jylle ons maak baie draai. draai. Nee. Maar eers as ons klaar gewerk het. Ach. Ons het nie gevra of jy werk. We first work nee. and then we make nee. the draai. Nee, as moet nie kom vra antwoord jy so. We don't Want first make the draai and then forget to work. <laughs> Kaufi wil ons een kaltier change. No. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Welcome to a lovely Monday morning. How was Friday's show? And I'm not asking the two of you. I'm asking all our viewers out there. How was Friday's show, especially the news bulletin? <laughs> Why do you have, just ask about the show, Kalfi? Why do you have to bring in the news? So because everybody knows I was out so of town, I could not look at the show. So we did a man of a... The game was like, even the name of the man, as they sing, as they make the mouth around, make the noise, make the noise, what's it? And they sing like that. So, you have to give the feeling. Neville. Kaufi. <coughs> yeah. Uh, uh, I think <laughs> we tried our best with the news on Friday. Okay. Um, I think the news, according to some of the feedback that we got right uh, uh was um it wasn't that bad but good but mitch got completely out of hand on friday mm. what? Uh, with a topic that he brought up i was disgusted the whole show <laughs> No, I'm, 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 I'm very, I'm very honest and very serious. Right. Did never. you, did you speak to him after the show? I tried to stop him the whole show. 
I try to stop him. I try to create him eight here can't eight as a come here can't fat a comic truck here can't. It was a terrible show, Kaufi. Kaufi, la like defense, the war it prat. Was Jay Zal in the comment section said, "We was the unruly, unscrupulous men." So he, unruly, unscrupulous. Hey, oh, we've got the, we've got the comments coming through, mm. so la the tale, truth, the tale, truth shut up. will prevail, <laughs> and the truth shall set you free. <laughs> Asteria, Theodore, Mora, Mora, uh, Ethel, Konings, Doctor, Mora, uh, Heleni, Nambahu, Goeie, Mora, uh, Gladness, uh, Timothy, Good Morning, Asino, Mora, and Kaufie, that two was at the hand at Friday. Ik wil hulle pimp. Oh, jy is een pimper. Unscrupulous. Mm. Jy is een pimper. Get stitches. Ja. <laughs> get stitches. Shipahu <coughs> uh, Simpson. Morning. Uh, King Malume Mora Jens. Die topic van vrijdag wat Neville sy gaan net skiet wanneer hy wil. Het my diep aangeval. Ek is gedamaged. Uh, Malume, I don't know what the hell you are talking about. Ons ken niks van die story. Ons ken nie. Kalfi, jy wil glad nie weet nie. Shora Kawenji says, Morning top fans, MMC. Hope you all had a blessed weekend. Uit die hand uit hulle het nie eens gelees, net oor seks en pon Pinky goed gepraat. Yes, man. Wie is Pinky Neville? The show was full of Neville and Mitch men who talk. The news Neville survived. Say as to Mitch uh, Tangeni says, those two were very unscrupulous. Kofi. Mitch say, ye fat kama di papire and kapped it up the tafel. Oda. 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 Roviera says, fornication was the order of the day on Friday. Om te skof te kinders die twee. <laughs> Ken nie van wie praat die mense. Kijk nee, Kaufie, it, it got to a point on Friday where <laughs> we missed your voice of reason in the studio. Right. Because we couldn't stop ourselves anymore. We just... So the show had no sense of direction. No direction. It was direction. just everywhere, falling off the table. Alles. Don't even pick up and put right... There was no German parts that brought <sighs> order... To the studio. Weißt du? Weiß nicht. Ich kann euch nicht erst alleine lassen, dann Nein. passieren solche Sachen. Nein, und Scheiße kann machen. <lacht> ja. <lacht> I was Kaufi, just following orders. Kaufi, <lacht> <lacht> how was your time in Zumeb? Uh, I had a wonderful time. Nee. It was so great. The weather was fantastic. It rained, but not to the degree that you can't enjoy yourself. It rained and then it stopped and the weather was like... It wasn't hot, it was cool, yeah. and all that, with a whole bunch of friends and nee. making music. That was a lot of fun. Aye, mm. Nice, man. When, <laughs> when, when did you head back? We came back yesterday, mm. and uh, yeah, we actually had a very nice trip uh, coming back yesterday. It wasn't too busy. As you like a rei coffee. Mm-hmm. As, as jy jou vroom ochend reier? Yes, we prefer that. For what? Because then you miss out on all the um, northern traffic. Is it? So if you leave, let's say, by 9 o'clock in the morning, <coughs> then you safely back in Vintuk by 12, 1 o'clock. And then you've still got the afternoon with the family. So maar that's great. Vintuk, it must not be a wat to maak, says here. Nie. Yeah, I know, but you don't want to leave to my bed 4, 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah. Then the traffic is just so much, and then yeah. you arrive here late at night, and it's dark and yeah. all that. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I think for me, um, if I would drive from the north, that would, I would I would agree with you. That I would I would prefer to drive in the mornings because of that traffic flow. But uh, for the last 15, 16 years, as <coughs> as de facto Swakop Munders, me mm. and me and my family, mm. we literally drive around five or six right out of Swakop on a Sunday afternoon mm. because yeah, we all drug the last sap eight. Eight. So what we normally would do. Ons rei sê, so kom ons sê, ons rei 5 hier uit swak op uit. Mm. By 7, 7.30, we are in Okahanya. Okay. Want daar is die traffic, daar het het, as ons van swak op af, it's, it's really, everybody's back. And then we would do our weekly shopping in Okahanya. Okay. 
En dan komen ze so na achter ons een windhoek. En dan we just go to sleep. That's right. Ik is een mens wat. Ik like to drive like early in the morning. Nee. Like you you went to o'clock you went to Kitmans over the weekend. Yeah. How was that like? Oh, never. Well, mm. It was. I'm a god in Kitmans. Daar say. I'm a god in Kitmans. Daar say. Ik kom loop zomaar daar en ik word net. Is hij nee? Is hij? Is hij? Okay. <laughs> like I said, the funny part is, there are like three girls there, and uh, they, they are asking each other, is it him or what? So I'm like, it's a groot me net. What can I have with Joe? Say, hey, wie wil je gegroet het? Wie wil je gegroet het? Wie wil je gegroet het? Je kan wel die fans genoemd weer. Namme piens, like... Ik zei het, ik like, heb wel die fans genoemd. Ik is jouw fan niet. Een mens hou net van jouw video's. Ik is jouw fan niet. Maar ik had zo much. Ik ken niet, ik had net mijn self-esteem is nog niet zo. Van als April. Als April en als comedians en man. Zo, ik heb even ook in minister geïnbox en mijn shot geshoot. Ik wacht voor die reply. Is je jouw shot geshoot? Ja. Oké. Als je zo travel. Does your girlfriend, is she going with or you go by yourself? Oh, 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 oh she had to stay. Why? I'm going to get man. Oh, yeah, yeah. Extend some. Fat, she fat must see a, uh, of course, na, uh, bakkerin. Part, uh, bakkerin, die brood na bakkerin, die yeah, samen yeah, yeah. Ah, die vrouw moest met die is gepleed. Yeah, yeah. Mm. My, my wife, my vrouw also prefers that she goes with me if I travel to the south. <laughs> She mm. never. It's not that she, she prefers. Ne- you know what's going. Yeah, on. <laughs> my wife, my fro, will never let me go to the south by myself. To the north, she knows. No problem. Ach, what? But what's the problem with the south then? What is not the problem with the south? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's the real question. No? Yeah. <laughs> is it particularly Kitmans or Luderitz that she's more afraid of? Yera broer, van Rebert af seit seit. As a problem. The gloves are off. The gloves the, are the, off. The <laughs> devil play and he say the same. You just yeah. have to test for The gloves are cloth. Don't throw yourself a toots for coffee. The gloves, gloves are, are cloth. cloth. <laughs> <laughs> uh, was some nice man. Ne? And, when, nice. and when, when, did, when did you return? I came back Sunday. Oh, that's yesterday. Mm, yesterday. Okay. Yesterday I came back, man, and oh, I was like, nah. Yeah, ne? I was like a child. Uh, I was welcomed very well. The hospitality there was just amazing. Where did you stay? Uh, what is it? Central Lodge. Oh, Central Lodge is a nice place. Yeah, it's. I I, I don't know very why nice they don't uh, uh, do something about the canyon. They must just the canyon must just be. Oh, the canyon revamp- hotel. Yeah, they must just revamp it very now. Nah. The hotel is the hurt. Mm. It's just this. Big ass building. Yeah, the next is a cosy, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> you don't get the hotel feel when you're there. Yeah. You get that cosy uh-uh. vibe. Yeah, very much. <clears throat> I, of course, stayed in my favorite place in Tsumip. Oh, the Minan Hotel. Oh, the oh, Minan Hotel. Minan. I love that place. Yeah. Ne? The food is fantastic. Mm. The rooms are great. The garden, the open. And it's just opposite the town park. So you're like in this. There's garden th- type environment. It's fantastic. There's one thing I know about these hotels in Chumep. They always have these gambling places. Ne. Ah, means a double with a hotel. Ne. Oh, the, even, you mean those roulette machines yeah. and stuff? <coughs> yeah. And means of a bit of common and they come double beer to come and it's like just a chill spot. <laughs> chill spot. <laughs> Isn't there a hotel? It's like a grot wangels for me. Thank you with the capital T fra. Hey, Jay Frizzelli. Het jij met zelly of met die Mavutu gechip? Nee, ik eet niet met Mavutu's gechip. Oh, my kid, man. Oh, nee, hier keer niet. No, 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 no. Maar hou het niks gekomen vrijdag niet zo. En Kauwi was hier niet. Hé, hey. so, ik zit een en een bij hey, elkaar. Hij is waar, nee. Like, wat gaan we? <laughs> Wait a minute. Kauwi. Maar hmm? hou zit nothing on the show on Friday. Ja. En oh. Kauwi was niet hier. En Kauwi was niet hier. <laughs> Mm. What goes on tour stays on tour. Kaufi would have screamed Mavutus. <laughs> He's bad too, says Estomich. Uh, Robert Nidipo says, and it's still raining. Still raining or still raining? Eh, die Engels ook op een maandag, nee. Uh, Jürgen Gezep says, what's a power, Michael? Look alike, banner as die. Did Armand... Designed that billboard sometime back. 
<laughs> ja, das liegt es noch. Das ist <lacht> There is no such thing as bad advertising. Ah, ja. Does not exist. <lacht> also, also noch. Hey, Ganji, wie ist jouw Wattfoot? Waar het ik gemak? Uh, Stefanus James zei mentorship program. Mitch, you don't travel, please tell you, Stompy. Zei Tayshon. Good morning, MMC family. Kalfi, welkom terug. Ik dankie, is, dankie. Ik is blij jy is terug. Die mannen het vredag die show gekiel. Baie van ons het nou six packs van lach. Zei Masha, lie Masha. Uh, is toch mense, let's talk judge Shafi. He deserves a wife and three mavutus. We need to consider his heart. Can can Yangela he can choose his mavutus? State lawyer six mavutus. Joanna St Stephenson deserves a hot wifey and ten mavutus. So many top jitas. Fish rod guys, muchus of the week for wasting taxpayers' money. Uh, Rose Kaufi had never stock his canal and zoom it. Dilanis had ook. Biesums. Did, did, Aha. did you guys do the weather on Friday? Yes, I did the weather. Oh. I did. Did you tell everybody it's going to be so cold this morning? Yeah. So that's why nobody's wearing any jackets, any jerseys. It's cold in Vintuk and everybody is going to catch the flu, which is then going to be said, oh, it's COVID again. Yeah. I, I, um, and I don't know if you can hear in my voice. I feel a bit fluish since Friday. Yeah, so I right. was I was really very much just in bed the whole weekend, but I I so much uh, enjoy just being home. <coughs> so Kalfi verloor je gewag of het je die hele nabe getam kam. Die jongen zal je maar hier malume. Hey Ganji, ik zie malume James met de jou eie tye hier op Facebook gewees. Hmm, zo wat ik gezien. Kalfi, als het einde van die man is, dan komt die verhoudings. Hey, nou kom maar niet. Kalfi, geef toch voor ons. Ja. Die nieuws. Geef voor ons die nieuws. Monty News. This is Informante Live and these are our top stories. On Dangwa Town, through the office of the mayor, will soon launch its first mayoral fund initiative to assist community members of the town. The fund aims to improve the living conditions of needy on Dangwa residents during unforeseen desperate situations. Town spokesperson Petrina Shetalangao Mutekisha said they saw the need to support residents who find themselves in situations beyond control, hence the establishment of the mayoral fund. Shita Langao Mutikisha said this in line with the Harambe Prosperity Plan under the pillar Social Progress, with which the government reaffirmed its responsibility to take care of those in need and to create a conducive environment for all to succeed. It is in the same spirit that the Ondangwa Town Council recognized the existence of the different economic and social classifications in the town and that the mayoral fund was created to support where applicable, she said. A 17-year-old girl was raped by an unknown man in Vintuk's Goryanghap informal settlement after she was traveling in a taxi. According to the Weekend Crime Bulletin, the incident of rape happened on Thursday at around quarter to 12 at night at Goryanghap Dam. It is alleged that the survivor was raped after she was forcefully grabbed from a taxi and dragged into the darkness where the suspect had sexual intercourse with her without her consent. The suspect has not been arrested yet. And finally, a nine-year-old boy was caught by a crocodile in the Kavango River on Saturday. Mutumbi Richard Mwambu and his friends were looking after goats in a grazing area when the tragedy happened. According to the police, the young boy became thirsty and went to drink some water from the river where he was caught by a crocodile. The incident happened at about 1400 hours in the Runjarara village in the Indiona district of Kavango East. The body was not recovered and the next of kin have been informed. Your Trusco share price today, the 4th of April, is at $1.25 per share. Taking a brief look at the financial indicators, the Namibia dollar is trading against the US dollar at 14 Namibia dollars and 70 cents, <coughs> against the Euro at 16 Namibia dollars and 20 cents, and against the British pound at 19 Namibia dollars and 20 cents. This is Informante Live, and these were our top stories. You can find more on our website, which is informante.web.na.
This week is the last Easter week competition and it's going to be the big one. You stand a chance to win a business design workshop and up to three rounds of identity stylescapes worth $10,000 Namibia dollars. All you have to do is go and type in hashtag the AK Design CO in the comment section of the Informante Live Facebook page. The competition ends on Monday the 11th of April 2022 and winners will be announced on social media. Uh, Kalfi, bye bye, thank you for your news. Yes. <coughs> um, I think that last story of yours is a bit just hit sad, me, no? just hit me where uh, I don't want to be hit on, mm. a, on a Monday morning. Yeah, we, it is, it is really sad to see these stories. Look, it is the news, um, so it's not, you know, that I don't want to share this with our viewers and listeners. But yeah, to have a nine year old boy caught by a crocodile in the Kavango <sighs> River over the weekend, that is really, really tragic and really, really just so sad. You know, looking after goats, you know, in a grazing area and then obviously, you know, becoming thirsty, going down to the river to, to fetch a drink. And uh, yeah, then this happens. And the, 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 the real tragedy with these type of things, I mean, if a crocodile takes n not even a child, even a, a grown person, <coughs> you know, the chances for the body to be recovered is, is very, very slim, Neville. It's... It's very sad. So, yeah. Our condolences to the family. You know what? My daughter, Ayanda, she, she, she's, she's still in her innocence. And she refuses to believe that children die. Mm. Mm. She thinks it's only, it's just daddy's age <coughs> and up and Oma's age that mm. dies. Mm. It was shocking to her when I told her that the reality of life is that children die. Yes. yes. No, but, but we haven't lived yet, Daddy. Right. So, so for, uh, you're a nine-year-old child drinking water at the river mm. 32 years after independence. Mm. We have to go there again. Do we have to go there again? Do we have to go there again? That there's this no sufficient infrastructure in the Kavango region mm. for people not to go to the river. Still now that a nine-year-old child is being snatched and you have no choice but to go to the river. Yeah. Yes. If yes. you don't go to the river, you'll go thirsty. You, you go thirsty, yeah. And you die. And what is a crocodile to do? Right. A crocodile is hungry. But not only that, probably, you know, probably the, 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 the people go to a specific spot at that river most of the time. So now these crocodiles, they notice that. Yes. And they, they just lie there and wait. They lie there and wait. So if you want to have a drink of water, you first have to sidestep a crocodile yes. or two before you can, yeah. Yes. you know. And it's, 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 oh, guys, it's, it's, <laughs> and what's a crocodile to do? A crocodile is a predator. Mm. Mm. And a predator, all a predator does all day, I'm looking for food. That's all. I'm so going to hunt you. Down. I'm up. And I mean, this, this is a nine-year-old child. I mean, the size of a nine-year-old child is, is perfect for a crocodile. Yes. It's probably what the size of a springbok. we'd be looking at a child about this high, yes. hey, isn't it? Yes. Mm. Yeah. It's the size of a springbok. It's mm. the size of a springbok. And I remember... Grab, mm. clap, trek you under the water, free it you up. The death roll. The death roll. The death roll, mm. yeah. Huh? Mm. Yeah. Oh, mm. and and uh, I remember I asked you never like if if you were to be a president, what would you do? And you you talked about uh, bringing the pipes to the people, mm. uh, that mm. infrastructure. The in, uh, so and then we have our president here with S and T that adds up to almost seven hundred thousand. Mati, seven hundred thousand dollars. It's about fourteen uh, fourteen thousand five hundred per day, and it depends on w in which country he is. The president's S and T. Also, president's S and T. As he travel. Ah, yeah. We shall not start this Monday on a s somber note. How much will it cost to to, to bring that infrastructure uh, to the people just for them to have access to water, safe access to water? This is what we will do for you as a people. How much is that going to cost us? Mm. Yes. 
Ja, wat. Um, cowboy, uh, hoor cowboy. <laughs> Kaloi Bochter says, the problem is not the South. The problem is Neville and Mitch. <laughs> oh, yes. oh, nou krijg ik en Mitch die skuld. Kan je niet hoor, wat sê Stefanus James Ananias nie? Seite maak vrede. Verstaan jylle. Uh, moet dat jou karstens? Het sê, long time, moet dat jou. Uh, ja, nee, wat ons het besluit, kom ons, kom ons tam tam in Windhoekse weer. Walvis bij het niet meer die X-Factor nie, sê Malume. Uh, the big boys are live, Daniel Narib. Uh, Estomis competition with three rounds. Ah! What? Competition with three rounds, ah? I don't know, son. I don't also. Oh, oh um, re- referring to, no, 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 the prize in terms of the competition is a business design workshop and up to three rounds of identity stylescapes. So I'm not too sure what identity stylescapes is because it's style identity identity st- stylescapes. Is that a wingle where you can't scoop? Oh, okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> no. Identity. Identity. <laughs> oh, if you identity. Call it, it obviously has something to do with, with, with business design. Mm. Aha, you know? aha, I see. I'll go and find out a little Please. bit later. Or maybe you guys can go out and Google it. And yeah. Let us know what are mm. identity stylescapes. Eleni Nambahu says, someone must do something about these crocodiles eating people that side. It just don't stop. Very sad. I would love to know what the community leaders are doing. Mm-hmm. Are they engaging government for the last 32 years constantly on the issue of water mm. and the infrastructure issues that we struggle with there in the Kavango River? The, the, I wonder if, um, and, and I just don't know, but I'm just making maybe perhaps the statement is that, you know, when, when these uh, uh, youngsters that go out and look after the goats during the day, yeah. you know, when they go grazing, yeah. you know, typically what would happen is that, you know, the grazing around wherever they are staying in the village yeah. would be grazed away. And then you have to just on a daily basis go further and further and further. And then you find yourself probably in remote areas just mm-hmm. for the grazing of the goats, and then uh, you don't have the option but to go to the river. Why yeah. should there be a water infrastructure? Yeah. Because you are further away from the village. Or do you think that there should be centralized water points everywhere? They should, they should have centralized well, water points everywhere to, to ensure that um, people go to these specific water points. Right. But now, let's say, let's say that goat um, herds person is now basically it's closer to the river than to the centralized water point. If I had to walk, let's say, two, three kilometers to a centralized water point, but the river is basically just 200 meters away, mm. you know, would I still not just go to the river? <laughs> I'm, I'm not too sure if there is a solution here. I know, I know this is tragic and I know this is sad, but I mean, what type of infrastructure in terms of water points would we need to establish? Coffee. Man, and, and this is not even a party politics issue. Oh. This is not even a swap or what mm. issue, whatever. Seriously. And, you know, if, if anybody who's even swap does not see anything wrong with this, if you're not willing to say, we are wrong, 32 years in power, mm-hmm. huh? and we talk, we talk about the Kavango. Guys, you must understand, when it comes to the Kavango region, mm-hmm. when it comes to the voting block, of the party. The ruling party. The ruling party. Right. That voting block of Swapo, mm-hmm. the density of that voting block comes from the Kavango mm. region. Jelle mm. IPC Deitsers and Boere can stem soos wat jelle wil. Die Kavangos, daar boe, the rural areas, hulle gaan maak hulle crazy by een plek. Your, your impulses tells you, I can't vote anything else but the ruling party. But how do you, after 32 years, think that seriously? We, ha- we could not think about anything yet. Right. Om mense te vry waar, dat mense opgevreed word van krokodille. Mm. That's utter bullshit, guys. And we all know that Rundu, after Vintuk, yes. is the second biggest. Hello. It's, it's not a town anymore. 
It's actually, you can... It's a city. It's a city. Mm. So, Rundu is the second biggest place in Namibia, yes. after Windhoek. Population density. Mm. And, uh, what, 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 what do the people in the south struggle with? Or what struggle is it? You guys must you don't struggle. I don't, I, don't, I don't really know. Ne? Are they, are they mostly social, mostly are they it's unemployment. Unemployment. unemployment okay. yeah. But they know other social issues, such as maybe too much drinking, alcohol. Uh, uh, typically, mm -hmm. that would go with unemployment, Employment, isn't yeah. it? So you've got, you got this sliding effect. Yeah. And then later on, what? Assaults, murder, yeah, the rape. The youth struggles with a lot of unemployment. And uh, the thing is that most government uh, uh, parastatals hire people from other towns, other regions. Right. So, and the youth was all striking about that. Also, there, uh, the police from there, uh, from 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 uh, from the south, mm -hmm. are also from another region. The police are from another region. Parasitals. So are you so telling me? Are you telling me that Damara policemen or Shivambo policemen, <laughs> Kavango policemen yeah. in Cape Manso? Even the town, uh, the councillors. <laughs> also from another region. <laughs> oh, no, man. <laughs> Chief of police is from another region. But you must remember we are all Namibians. So we are all Namibians. <laughs> tribalism has no place in Namibia. Look, uh, it's, it's, it's not about tribalism. Can you not see coffee? Can you not see We are all Namibians. I'm just saying. Mitch, <laughs> he can't help himself. You must understand it, sir. Mitch will the vambus eat the seed eat the hair. He suck. Ah, ah, be quiet. He suck ni vambus south of Vendukni. The vambus mood born to cheap. play. Hello, mood cheap. I can't. <laughs> Mitch can't help himself, but to what suck he remains and get months. What what suck are you so? Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of what? Doctors from Cuba. Yeah. Like, have you ever wondered why? I know because they have uh, they have the skills. Yeah, like we need we need the skills that they have and the training from them. I, I thought so. Maybe that's the same. Uh, uh, what skills? No. <laughs> Look at this guy. Come on. What skills? So <laughs> oh, you see you see who comes shines no and so. <laughs> Uh, no. Mitch, Mitch, on the serious note, there, I've, I mean, I've, I've, I've walked the streets of Kietmans in Zeiplachte, uh, Kronlein. Mm. I, I, I love those little suburbs. Yeah, yeah, yeah suburbs. And, and, and when I have a sit down with people in the south, um, when people speak about joblessness in the south, mm. and, and the fact that the youth, there's nothing to do. do there's nothing, there's to, nothing do. to do. And, and, and it's always what people are saying in the South. The men drink not so. It's all they can do. That there's no re recreation. There's no, there's nothing else than the only recreation that people know in certain areas are. As in to gaan, ons moet, ons piki, ons gaan hang, and what, what. There's nothing else really to do. And, 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 oh, it's, it's, it's sad. And I, I understand also where you come from. Mm. We joke around about stuff like this. But yeah. then again, on a serious note, something needs to be done to uplift the, the communities in the south of our, mm. of, of, of our country. Mm. That's just how I feel about yeah. it. And, and it's not because of the... Like, the, if you go there, now, you'll see how these people, they stay together there as one. Like, she's all they own the scene. They man at the man at the name of Ruha Throat, Father La Play some. The men's a play Nassam. Except that, like, the, 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 it's um, um, Mr. Mensa that they had from another play of, or Mr. Mensa in a certain position they had, they're real the men's and if I die play because he, except that that is, that is who come the youth that can't strike at the another. I see, I see a lot of coloreds and white people who make a good living in Oshakati, on Gwediva, yeah. on Dangwa. I see that. Yeah, I can't parf on a little. And never, you can't stamp it. 
Ja, stamp Stamp breed. Breed, waarvan ons, ons het die drijwe plaas mm. van ons noord over het En, en hy lees ook, en die, die youth het gaan gestrijk oor dit, en ek sê, hy is waar oor hulle nou sikkel daar, die youth complain oor dit. Nou, uh, an interesting topic that I, that I, oh, uh, a comment that I got here now is from Regina Cathy. Mm. She says proper consultation just needs to be done for when they plan for water infrastructure, where there was an incident here in Namibia where gov- whereby government put a tap closer than where the river is, and people used to pass by the tap heading for the river. The lady said that they prefer the river because it's the only time they used to catch up with their friends. So it's a social gathering spot. Mm. However, Joshua Hadula says, I fail to understand that Kavango has the best river lodges in the entire Namibia. Mm. Best first class lodges. Mm. The business community can create a trust account with the community leaders or regional councillor to make it a mandate to work on pipe infrastructure annually. However, the first news story that we read this morning mm. is the office mm. of the mayor of... Um, on Dangwa, uh, put up l- is launching a mayoral fund initiative to assist the community members. And the fund aims to improve the living conditions of needy on Dangwa residents during the unforeseen desperate situations. Yeah. So let's take a look at all these three, three aspects. One is a comment that says, no, we'd like to gather socially yeah. at the river. Yeah. The other one says, hang on a moment, get the lodges to put up a trust fund. Yeah. Uh, to mo- so in other words, we've now got private sector. Go, go to the private sector. Yeah. Okay. However, a solution could be that whoever the mayor of Rundu is, to, if it's in that region, of course, to um, put up a mayoral fund initiative, so that then comes out of the municipal yeah. r- r- side. Yeah. But conveniently, we are just dismissing government altogether here. Because should this not be a government role? It should be a Th- government this role. Should be a should government, this should be a Ministry of Water Affairs issue. Mm. No. The yep. Ministry of Water Affairs should be looking into this. I think this child having been killed by this crocodile should be squarely put onto the front door of the Ministry of Water. Why, uh, why can't the uh, parents not sue the There needs to the be government. an entity yeah. that needs <coughs> to be held accountable. There, there needs to be some thing, some entity that needs to be held ac- accountable. And in my mind, it should be government. Mm. Government should be feeling the brunt of this. I mean, uh, most of the times when something happens, we, 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 we find a solution <coughs> to it. Like uh, the, this rev- riverbed, like the side of David. A, yeah, a lot of girls were raped there, a lot of people were robbed there and so on. People built a bridge. Yeah. They cut off the grass there, so it was tall grass, and you yeah, can, they cut it off. So so people can be safe walking down is, there. Is, so is, is that the Magdalena Stoffel's uh, bridge, bridge we're talking yeah. about? Yeah. Yeah. So <coughs> we did that. So now we see a lot of people are being eaten there. Can't we find, even if we don't bring the water up to the people, like put in the pipes to the people, but just right. a safe route for them to collect the water. Like, did to weapon 5 million mm. salted technique and so on. So, 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 let's say somebody br- g- breaks through the fence into the Itosha pan to go and collect Mopani worms mm. and gets caught by a lion, gets mm. eaten by a predator, mm. such as a crocodile. It's mm. just another predator. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen that also. That was also a, 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 a new story. Yes. So, uh, but but I, the, the, the thing is, that just in terms of the river, I think the river is just a, such an essential source for life. Yeah, yeah. Mm. You know? Mm. Okay, that is, it's all good and well, Kaufi. And, and I think what Joshua Adula says, and, and, and that's not far-fetched, it's very true that people probably, you know, go and frequent, you know, the banks of the river as, mm. as a social gathering. Mm. Mm. But then again, l- let's think about this. I mean, it's a tradition that stems now for well over two, three hundred years mm-hmm. where people p- probably meet at this river. But then again, <coughs> come on, we need to evolve. If, if, if infrastructure no. is not put in place mm-hmm. so that people start understanding Yes. The dangers of the social gathering spot. gathering spot. You see, after the mosquitoes, the second most <coughs> animal that kills in Africa are hippos. Yeah. 
There you they go. are hippos in that river too. They are hippos. So it's it's hippos. They're crocodiles. Mm. You know, you can't just easily walk around those areas yeah. at night because the chances that you'll meet up a, with a hippo is pretty good. Yeah. And but <coughs> yeah, and I think uh, uh, Doctor Article is in in the right path. Mm. And he started mm. his campaign very early, mm. and he can use this as a political again strategy. You know, we'll see. Isn't we'll Doctor Art- Article from there? No, from he's, he's a fumble. Oh, oh. Mm. yeah, but he can use this to his mm. advantage. He started his campaign now. He started walking already. He's somewhere in Katatura now. I see. Is he walking? Yeah, he's okay. already walking. Yeah. <laughs> Talking about Katatura, <coughs> um, yesterday we we sadly said goodbye to an icon of Katatura. We said goodbye to um, Sisi Melba. Now, for some of you who are from Katatura or Komastal, uh, and if you happen to be a Namibian tourist or an international tourist who did come to Namibia at one time in your lifetime, um, Oshikaindu is a place uh, in the suburb of Vanaheda where this woman for well over 25 years um, Sisi Melba where she um, started an eatery there and uh, a very 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 popular place which basically formed part of Katatura culture Um, um, she passed on yesterday um, sadly passed on um, Mitch, you've been there to the house mm. yesterday, oh. and um, there were probably a lot of cars there yesterday. A lot of cars. It was almost like the street was blocked off. Yeah. Like, everybody was there. Yeah, yeah. And and I didn't know, like, she, she passed away the, in the morning, right? Mm. And it was already organized. Yeah, so... And mm. I was like, how did this... Pe-? And I think to on Friday, it was not going to be part. Oh, okay. Mm. And I guess like, <coughs> how did they come together? So never like explain to me and Kaufi. Error mm. tradisias. Iman no gestere wat soos no pum. What's the way forward? How do you guys? No, I, I, I don't think it's any different from what what Damara people do or, or what Oshuambo people do is mm. because uh, the, the first thing is we need to get together. We need to get to the house. Mm. Right. Now, obviously, the, the Ova Herero is the second largest tribe in Namibia. Mm. So, of course, and you will have large families who know each other. So, it's, it's unavoidable that if Sisi Melba passed on yesterday morning, that they, you will just have a sea of people. Mm. And I mean, she was a well-known figure in in in, in, in the community. In the community, yeah, mm. because uh, she's uh, she's she's a community icon. She's everybody of the babalas is of the net for the lekker tate for the ons gaan sisi melba se plek to. The name's uh, Smiley. Smiley. It comes mm. from there. Skapkop. Skapkop. Yeah, she made it look. Uh, oh. She made it cool. Yeah. Um, skapkop te eer dat sy cool gemaakt ja. hy was, like, ek gaan eet a smiley. Die heros het hierdie knie skuif hy, bees mm. knie skuif. Mm. Ja, maar julle die ding? Sissy Melba also, ne, you created a lot of high blood pressure for, for many <laughs> ja, of us. Ja, oog. Ek, ek ondou die poote, ne. Die poote. Ja, oog, ek het baie van dit ook gehoor. Ja. Kofi, hoe is julle sy arrangements, julle, as, as iemand nou? Well, you mean the Germans now? Mm, yeah. yeah. Well, typically, uh, what we what, what what's more the the case with us is that if somebody passes away, let's say it's a, another family member, yeah. uh, uh, you know, we 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 stay away. Yeah. And we, you know, we we give privacy. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so we, if somebody dies, let's say a friend of mine, yeah. uh, it's not as if we arrive at the house in in. Droves and walk in and say, "How's it? Uh, sorry, man. Uh, we 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 allow that family to first, you know, have their morning in private." So all this work, all the all the and maybe with drones, good to get net from the drone off. But then, but that, but then, what happens is you you are then advised of when the funeral is or when the service is. And yeah, then then you go and play your pay your last respects at the. So wait, you guys wait don't even minute. have a funeral WhatsApp group. 
No, man, we, oh, it gets communicated in the media and it gets sent out. Of course, it gets so Kaufi, <coughs> if you pass on now, mm -hmm. 10 o'clock this morning, right? And uh, I and I speak to Zelly, mm -hmm. for example, and no, no, laat na maar acces hier. So I can't be your eyes. Oh, no, no, it huh? doesn't get done. Mm -mm. You, you'll get maybe f a couple of phone calls and all that kind of stuff. But we don't have to be No, no, no. no, no, privacy. no, no. You, allow the pri you allow the privacy of that family. This is very interesting. And, um, it, it, it's the same uh, as uh, for Tamara's, like you said, the moment somebody pass on, Everybody is at that house. Ah, he says da word, da word, da word. <laughs> it's, yeah. No, it's it's cultural. Yeah, obviously. It's cultural, um, man, but you know, you know something that I that absolutely hate. You know, let's say one of my family members would pass away and pass on and all that, you know? Yeah. You know, I would I, I I would just even when somebody passes away in let's say my circle of friends or the f remaining family, I would <coughs> send my condolences. But then I'll shut up for at least Five to six to, until we get to the funeral. But um, he if I say, "Oh, my condolences." Listen, if there's anything you need, just phone me. Just I'll, I'll uh, that's, <laughs> I hate that when yeah. people do that. Yeah, because there's nothing to be done anymore. Mm. You know, this person has passed on. It's yeah. okay. We are all okay. Yeah. So when you when we're just sad, and uh, yeah, we'll see you later at the at the service. Gaufi, you there's people there. The oh, last thing I want if one yeah. of my family members passes on is like have hundred people in my house. Nee man, no moet ek met die lot sit ook nog. Gaat huis toe, sien jou by die funeral. Los my eis. Nice man, sien jy kom sê, oh Kalfi, my condolence is, he said, don't sweat it man. We all gonna die one day. Yeah. Is die soort nee? Man nee. Kalfi, kyk as iemand sterf, by ons is a groot geval. Even as die vrou nou 90 jaar was, ons wil weet wat het gebeur. Sy kan 100 jaar oud, wat sê, wat het gebeur? Ja. Sy is gevang dier een krokodil. There you have it. Klaar gepraat, gaan huis toe. Nee, my ons, ons sal vraag, like, het sê, moet nie so sê nie. Like, we are so surprised that a 100 year old oma is dead. But, 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 but to, to bring it a little bit more closer, Mitch, I think, and, 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 and I guess, you know, over the years, uh, black people, especially in a corporate <laughs> setting, uh, there's, a, there's a lot of jokes being thrown back and forth. Uh, we as black people, we would always joke about how cold white people, people are mm. towards their loved ones who passed on. Say, let net die vrou gaan toegegooi en toe sit finish en klaar. Uh, on the other side, on the contrary, white people would always make fun of us as to how long <laughs> and how much verlof daar vat ons, want die family moet uit Ochinene uitkom en uit Omaruru uitkom. And how many of your family is dying every month? And, and it's always thought of or frowned upon that. Nee, wil jy lieg nee. You just want to take leave. It's not really your family that passed away. Yeah. But it's really my, my uncle. Mm. And last week was really my cousin who passed away. <laughs> and, and the week before that was my other cousin. cousin. I swear, Kaufi, <laughs> I've had four family members who died in the last four weeks. I swear to you. <laughs> but, but, but. Because uh, white communities are so small. Mm, they, don't, they don't see that. They don't understand that. They don't understand that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But but I must say I think in conclusion um, just to say we just want to um, if there are some of the families of of um, Sissy Melba who's watching the show mm. uh, we will definitely going to be doing the traditional thing mm -hmm. sure we will be going there <coughs> uh, give our support van wat nou gebeur koffie diri jelle week koffie tea elke aand mensen kom sit ons maak vet koek what do you think? And uh, uh, that's just of interest. Yeah. And and, and well, then obviously I don't hope I don't hope it happens soon. But yeah. Anyway, what do you think is going to happen when the the founding father passes? Oh. 
it, 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 How do you think that's going to affect Namibia? And, and what, what do you think is going to happen? Do you think we're going to just really go slow for quite oh, some time? Yeah. It will be... I remember when, when Mandela passed on. Sure. When Dalibonga, I love calling him on his uh, ancestral name. When Dalibonga passed on, South Africa became, a, I mean, it, it just, to a standstill, mm. came to a standstill. And, and the level of respect that South Africans and the world have for Mandela is just, it was just priceless. Obviously, in Namibia, uh, Tatekuru is our founding father. Um, uh, we will give him the proper respect when the day mm. comes. Mm. Uh, I do believe that um, a lot will be done the day something like that happens. Right, right. So, um, <coughs> yeah, um, uh, he's loved, he, he's probably loathed by some, mm -hmm. but then at the end of the day, it's um, he he will be and will still be regarded, you know, in sure, the obviously, highest. I mean, yeah, it yeah, would yeah, just yeah, be yeah, sad. Yeah, state funeral, yeah. wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. Time is few. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Well, there's this uh, there's this thing that I wanted to ask you, ne? Like in the hetero culture, do you have a you, like pe on Susan on said men's about uh hotel can fat nos like that is a group hot that is the owens of us no uh uh what check slag, mm. you check get, yeah and then is that no the from men's about cook you can just check. The the from men's about no pay the meat us the from men's about pay the fat cook and fat us check yeah and pay yellow then actually no the professional moners yes checked but on said did that mm -mm. we have you will <coughs> chances are you will come to Sisi Melba's house mm. tonight and there will be um, a group of women mm. who sits in the corner mm. who mm -hmm. are just wailing. Yes. It's their job. Mm. Oh, that, it's, 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 a, like, their it's job like rent a crier. Yeah. It's, it's all they do, whether they are rented or whatever, but they willfully make sure that mm -hmm. they the create mm. a mood that is uh, suitable to the situation but you mitch and i would never be able to do that job because we are laughers yeah yeah when it comes to the laughing time why are we not being rented yeah ne? as you as you as you love uh uh what rent for laughter or whatever yes. and then for your because the three show. of us will just go and sit in a corner and laugh ourselves today. The, 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 the problem is that we are the ones who create the laughter. <laughs> exactly, but <laughs> laughter creates more laughter. <laughs> yeah. So on screen, you mean that we also comedy show? Yeah, na kahit joke lah. But does crying create more crying? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> don't play. It creates more crying. And then, and somebody must not do this to a black. Can yeah. you cry? Can you cry? Oh. The, ready, steady, cry. <laughs> I can cry. Okay, go for it. One, One two, two, three. It's like asking a 51-year-old guy to have a quick erection now. <laughs> we're not going back to Friday's topic. No, 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 no we're not going back. I'm just telling you what my situation I'm just putting an analogy there so that you understand. Come let's go a few comments. Rente Kraya says, Joshua Hadula. Rovira says, Och, and that's all is canail. All is canail. All is gemaakt for heil. All is heilers. Net so. Uh, Joshua Dula said, God forbid, but if the founding father passes on, ish corruption will skyrocket and things that were under the closest will surface, but it will be a public holiday. Uh, Tangeni with the capital says, fear us darkies, we got no respect for money. Us blasts, weddings, funerals, baptism, confirmations, we don't care. Um, uh, Muhao says, one time my mom went to an Omkalo funeral. Omkalo means colored. Okay. <coughs> oh, sorry. To fra ek, who was the begrafnis? To say, si, young meken, that was a gesikkel om die gat toe te gooi. Want die manna was biki stara. Ons het gesing en sing tot ons nie kan nie. Apparently, black people's graves are closed in five minutes. Ah, yeah. On sing young. Uh, maybe if your family doesn't push away, my family push. 
Have you seen that video? Ooh. Come on. Have you yeah. seen that video? Hey, <laughs> pass away. I I understand that woman. She passed away yeah, herself. Yeah, she, she also. Uh, yeah. Somebody uh, loaded the video and was giving uh, condolences, and I was like, oh, it it it. It it it, it came at a time when Namibia was sad, mm. and it was so like she made it so fun. Very fun. Yeah. Rovira says blacks want to come see the body to tell the villagers that it is true. I is rare to it. Urag in full stories. Dante Lowe says there is a culture where the bodies are buried and dug up now and then to celebrate them and see how they are doing. Oh yes, Dante, That's in that Mexico. happens. No, in Madagascar. <coughs> In Madagascar. In Madagascar, yeah. In Mexico, you've got the Day of the Dead. The Day of the they, Dead. Where they also celebrate, but I don't think, think that they, they dig it. They they dig dig it. it but Madagascar does. They actually dig them up. Um, sometimes, they like, up. every, not every year, but that. And then they, <coughs> they dress the bodies up and then dance with them and then put them back. And That's why black funerals are expensive, long gatherings, say Estomich. Uh, Jürgen Gesep says, black death is just another form of black tax. And father help... As daar nie begraaf, dan is Polis in Prekes. Oh, yes. Oh, okay. ja. Okay. Polis is nie. Um, Moetomba, Angel Neville de Alvaerio are the fourth largest group accounting for 7% of the population of Namibia according to World Atlas. Huh? Oh, is it? Uh, so, who's second? The, uh, it's Tamaras. Kak, man. It's Tamaras, Neville. Mm. I believe, Mitchell, probably Mutumba the Kavangos. Probably the, no, you, you, Mitch, you're probably correct. Probably the Kavangos are the second largest. Mm. Come Which would about. be the biggest Wambos? Yeah, Wambos are the mm. biggest. Ah, Wambos are like 99 <coughs> percent. Okay. Share the zero point zero point seven and stuff. Joshua Dula says black tax family funeral arrangements. The whole community is involved, even those that didn't know the deceased. <laughs> Estomi says the Norwegians here they attend the funeral and after have a gathering for everyone. Family and friends gather before, but not many people. Only close people. It's like how Kaufi explained it. Uh huh. Mohau oh. <laughs> privacy. Iman moet die fam gaan represent. That is our support to the fellow blacks. Sure, sure. Uh, one of my favorite eateries. Uh, <coughs> rest in peace, Meme Mundu Wanje. Um, says JJHK. Uh, Sebi, <coughs> die word ne. Ombumbuangoro is as die knieskeef. Mm. Oh, on Boom Banquaro. Ah, it's lekker. Ah, yeah. I crack you night again. But it's lekker. Oh, no. It's too much fun. I had just said something that I so many years ago had happened with my father's grave. He was always going to sit there, man, and go heal. And he said, no, to the old man's grave. He had a forgotten grave to go heal. Oh, he, <laughs> he went to go cry at the wrong funeral. <laughs> Please don't tell me that. He, he went and he c cried at the wrong funeral. Yeah, he was crying well, at my uncle's funeral. But uh, there was also another funeral. <laughs> oh, shame, man. Couldn't you guys just help him write? The way the guy stood up, man, when I told him it's actually... No, Mitch, caught him man. Too, <laughs> like, so what did you say? <laughs> no, man. What? Oh, how? Caught him. him. <laughs> <laughs> like, did not his son do his own man. He's caught him. <laughs> <laughs> Dyslexic funerals. <laughs> oh, and I get a laugh never. Imagine I am the one telling him that I get a laugh never and means a heal. So that is the pastor of the Oh, no, imagine something. There will be, <laughs> there will be, and, and even in our time of sorrow, coffee at black funerals, I tell you we're gonna have so much laughter this week at uh, cc melba's <laughs> wake and the services because people will go there and 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 share, stories, and share stories as to what has happened there and she was a funny funny woman right oh she was right she was a very funny woman so uh, every time i the last time i was there was uh Probably about a month, month, a month, a month and a half ago, and um, and she was just sitting there. To the cookers cup, cup, and cup So, but yeah, Sisi, kind of rest in peace, uh, and we will be providing our support um, as as the informante to 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 showcase exactly you know what her history was as 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 a community leader mm -hmm. and somebody who who basically leaves a legacy mm. Uh, mm. behind. I, I remember a few months ago, last year, 
we we also lost um a similar person in the name of Tate Jafet Elau. Oh yeah. Oh yes, I who remember was that. Also very much an institution in Katatura. And a lot of people I mean yesterday people were asking mm. um, um um and and making comments like, you know, what's gonna happen to CC Melba's eatery now because mm -hmm. yeah. she started this off yeah, with uh, the children. That, that's absolutely right. Mm. Uh, are, are there people, maybe family members, and what that can continue, can carry we, that? We we really hope so. We but hope so. Because right. somebody said yesterday, unfortunately, it seems like in the case of Tate Jafet, uh, because he was a businessman and he yeah. was a guy who did that, it seems like there's not much going on in Abraham no, Street. The kids anymore. actually open. Mm. Um, um, they very they are very close. Uh, 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 Friends of mine. Oh, okay. Uh, Javed, this was my pa's brother. Let's some good work and what. And kids actually met their brothers and sisters for the first time at his funeral. Yeah, ne? Yeah, uh, Javed did most clump kind of. Ne, um, Javed did he spill? He did spill. Yeah, he knew why he was put on earth. Mm. So, uh, the kind of said a bar that was coming. Yeah, ne? And it's not a yellow. Mm. Uh, but that's all right. Like the place where he must get bright out mm. and all that, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. The devil is lost. The devil is lost. Mm. Ay, BJ. And that's Ay. the thing about kids, ne? Mm. I can't even be in my kind of salary. They say the father mm -hmm. makes the money. Right. The son spends the money okay the grandson destroys the legacy that's what they say mm. this is right but isn't that the normal circle of life that, that's probably it because if you don't understand how hard i worked for this yeah especially if you like one of these uh trust fund babies ah. you basically just get born into yes wealth and richness yes you didn't really quite earn it yourself. Nah. You, you, you were just by pure chance and luck yeah. born into it. Yeah. And that is where the spending then comes. That's where the spending comes. And then comes. the grandson, he goes and destroys it all. Yeah. And then yeah. the next one has to go and build it up again. So the whole thing starts again, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. That's another analogy. Mm. <laughs> because I, I know everybody on this stream at least knows two or three people that stayed in the street, uh, in the street or their uh, mm. community that actually inherited a large amount and waste the money. Wasted that, that money in three, four months. That can so? I can't. Like, oh, my goodness. Very, yeah, I miss Wom Yafet so much. He was just the kind of soul, such a people's person. Very, very much. Mm. I'll never forget Vedi. I'm talking about in the early 90s when Tate Jafet started praying. Mm. And then he would sit with me and Lazarus and Tese Amunyela and all our guys who were more or less in the same age group. Mm. And he would, and Uncle Jafet could speak all languages. Mm. He would speak German fluent. Really? Afrikaans yeah, fluent. Ne. Kosa fluent. Zulu fluent. Wow. Herero, Tamara, Swana. Well. Everything. He speaks it mm. fluent. Jy oh. kan no mee in a hoek trekkie. Niks. Wow. Niks. Ja. Um, en daar sê ze lie, swerfgeld, asjeblief. Ok, man. Ja. Swerfgeld. <laughs> so, uh, uh, um Jafet always used to tell me, never... Make it. Max Seeker, if you went on a business trip and you are on your way back from your business trip, as je in oka handja kom, say yo fro, my fro, ek is op pad, heis tu. Never come and support. Surprise your yeah. wife at yeah. home. <coughs> right. That the Javed no who but Dulje. Ah ah, make it. Listen. They self understand. What I'm telling you. Yeah. As J N report come. Bell. Bell. Say my fro. I'm on my way home. I'll be there in two hours time. If you want peace in, in your, your life. life. Yes. Yeah. Let. Your Best wife not know, know about things. Yes. 
I've been telling my wife ever since I got married. Mevrouw. Zelly, I'm on my way home. Ja. Laat die ander man hart loop. Het is van die surprise dag. Het is van die iemand van surprise dag wat ik amper heb lepsie gekregen. Zo hard zo pijn. I remember. Yeah. I remember. You told us. Yeah. En jy uh, moet, uh. moet dit nooit doen. En daar is my number one rule. As het oor 12 is. En ek is nog hier by die huisie. En ek en die vrouw mens blij saam. Ek kom hier by die huis terug. Ek kom hier so ochend terug. Ja, nee. Ja, want sy, sy ken mos in haar kop. As die jou uitgaan, ek kom, ek sal sunrise. Hmm. Maar nou wil jy 12 uur kama terugkom. Skierlik, terwijl die vrouw die routine al klaar het. Hmm. Ah, ah. Hmm. Moe nie maar terugkom. Trini says, thought you needed a court order to exhume other than that non take place at it's a criminal offense uh yeah zeli kotse is our mmc swara is ya gan jy is dood reg is die swara dai is die swara is die swara is ons ma wutu you must watch yeah mmc ma wutu they show you must watch i blew it ne uh, waar, waar kan ik het kijken, Tayshon? Is het on, on Netflix of waar? Het zou interessant zijn. Oh Roviera zegt, is ja mijn baas is al die Ons cross daar. Ons, ons, ons check daar, uh, Ro. Um, I'll definitely be there later. Mind those who get drunk at funerals now asking the deceased for money. The deceased <laughs> owes them. Black funerals can be hectic. Some singing loud. Out. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, 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 is very true. <laughs> I remember... Laz- Lazarus Jacobs, his father. Mm. And if we get to Grootfontein, then Lazarus' father would sit there. Very pissed off. His late father. Mm. Hmm. I said, that is that is Simon. Ongoe. What is that? Hmm. <sighs> Jelle ken die man. Die deitser. Die kaufman. Hey, 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 bleed daar zo. Jullie kennen dat eens. Jullie kennen dat iets, hij bleed daar zo. Zeg ja. Hmm. Dat is ja, we are waiting. Die man heeft gedood gisteren. En we like, dat is in, we are so sorry to hear that Kaufman died. Nee, die man schuilt mijn geld. <laughs> Bad thing, eh? Like somebody owes you probably like 50k and who said? But that is why we you have a, an estate. Yeah. So the moment you pass, your your money gets frozen. Yeah. At the bank, whether you have money or you don't, or you are an overdraft, or whatever, everything gets just frozen. Mm. And that is why with these li- little funerals policies come in, they are very important to have. Yeah. And the nice thing about funeral policies, you can have more than one. You can have yeah. 10 if you like. You yeah. can have 20. Because they have to pay out 48 hours upon presenting the death certificate. Mm. Because if you don't have that money, your bank account is frozen. Mm. You Nobody can get to your money to yeah. pay for your stuff. Oh yeah, like whatever you So say. now what happens is <clears throat> if you are lucky to ha- enough to have friends and family, then they will have to fork out the money if you have not catered oh, what, for what, what if you, What if they can't? So what, then we will not ask you. Hello? <coughs> Hello? Because the you know. estate has to be closed at some stage. The yeah. assets have to yeah. be brought to the liabilities. Then we will be able to pay or be able to pay. Yeah, so n- now that I have a job, Mose, 8 to 5, I mm. was added on the family funeral WhatsApp group. <laughs> and you know when we have this meeting. The, the thing, so you have a voice now. I have a voice now. So when we have this meeting, they call me Omemit. Omemit. Uh, Omemit. Omemit. And then uh, there comes a time where people have to ask me, we the polis op, op the mens wat gesterven. And then you must just see the whole cold air, just the breeze like. Amal is net still. Amal is net still. Yeah. Maar ik moet die door zeggen, ik ga het laat ik nog. En dat was als wel die geld, ik wil wel niet hier niet. Dan hoor je net die mensen strijd daar. I, I, I never knew that people can actually take out a funeral policy on my name mm-hmm. without me knowing about yeah. it. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, people yeah. do that. No, I'm sure you have to declare. 
I, if, I, if you want one on my name, then you should tell me. I must just have your ID copy. Like, I have, I have, I have most two exes. I have a funeral <coughs> cover on both of them. Right. Yeah. So and they're I'm still in place. Waiting. I'm just waiting. <laughs> I'm patiently waiting. As you may date, I a funeral policy. So, so <laughs> well, effectively, what you, let's say you're a business owner. You can have a funeral policy on each and every one of your staff members. <laughs> Actually, Why did you put it that way? No, yeah, dungas under. Especially, especially Actually, if you're in the transport business. Mm. Because, I mean, what are the chances yeah. that those drivers are going to drive into it's, something? Uh, it's a high, high risk job. Right. Mm. So, you can do that. But, you know, you have the ID copy. Of ID. So because I know, copy. I know of a lady that's in Khobabas that uh, pays people $200 and she puts them on a funeral policy. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Even die as he owns a dabby bar, so then let him hear when he does it. Bruh. These funeral policies, they're relatively cheap. They're like 30 bucks. And, so, and, and, and that's just with 30 dollars. Yeah, so can you imagine, yeah, yeah, you basically just go and let's say every second month or something like that, you go and take out a funeral policy, let's say on your wife or family member. Or and you just start staggering that. That if that person should come to die, then mm. those you just basically that take those funeral bills and use the death certificate. You know that lady from South Africa that killed her family members, boyfriends and what? Rosemary and Glovo. Kini, mm. Kini is talk uh, is it your family, Uka? Kini. Uh, yeah. Uh, Rosemary and Glovo. Uh, Google her. She took policies and had the people killed and cashed in on it. And most were family members. <coughs> A yellow SAP lady cop. I remember her. Wow. And she was so brazen, even at the time when she got arrested, you could see how vile this was woman was. She, she's mm. uh, that's a no evil conscience. Person. Yeah, that's an evil person. I no just conscience. see her like, yo, yeah. my ex right there. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Mitch, tell me your story in the bar. Oh, yeah, that is a throne, eh? Ozzy mm. Ellen. Uh, mm. Is that one of what I story come from Ozzy Ellen? So, say, say, scream for the young men who are tombo good by her. So, as the as the men say no, maybe so I crack by the bar. That begin for the old ones. But yeah, it's your it's your police who can face all club by Ozzy Ellen. When was with the two hundred and three? So she pays the people two hundred dollars, and then the people she puts them on her funeral. Cover. So ho. Mm. So as I mentioned, I was for we wow. said I tumble for coffee and some cash in it. Wow! But it's a nice business. Eh? To make yeah. matters easier for the ones we leave behind, we should at least have a policy that can cover coffin tombstone costs. Says Tangeni with a capital T. Um, I just want to be cremated. You guys can just basically flush me down the toilet. Ne? <laughs> <laughs> Vedi Kayere says, you don't even need a copy of the ID. Just give the correct spelling of the name and date of birth. Kijk wow. Kijk net daar. Um, Jürgen Kayseb says, um, in Grootfontein there are funeral policy entrepreneurs. Mm. It's oh, a right. whole syndicate of women that literally chase down those with one foot in the grave. <laughs> Sadly, it's more money making than wanting to assist. I need a death certificate for work here, VJ. It is, it is so true. No relations at all. And global surname, very common. Can you tell me, then global surname. Um, I, I, thought, I thought it's a very strong Zimbabwean surname. Um, is there, is there, if you are in global, do you necessarily have family in, 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 in Zimbabwe or not? Um, because it's, um, I know people who are, you know, the story of the, uh, the um, surname Moyo is a very strong Zimbabwean surname, but I know South Africans who also carry the Moyo <coughs> surname. But <coughs> just an yeah. interesting. Also, yeah. it must be death and uh, weddings and what you prat, what you can talk about. So, must prat van, uh, do you think uh, uneducated females, would I say, or educated females are much more uh, enjoy much more of the marriage. She can ask you an educated from and said, can you say the true mirror as the educated men? I don't 
haven't answered on such an <laughs> unscrupulous <laughs> question that you asked me. Ik ik weet nou op onze dat debate gaat oor dat op Facebook nee. Uh-huh. En mense voel uneducated vrou mense waardeer meer het trouwe as wat educated vrou mense. If if we say educated and uneducated are we talking about um academic education? Academic. People, uh, people feel like people, uh, women that are uh, uh, educated and they have the masters in what, or they have their own career path line chicken. Mm. And they turn to 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 divorce much easier than a woman that is not educated. Oh, so the educated women divorce easier? No, no, yeah, easier than a woman that is not educated, though, because she will try to fix the uh, the. Mm-hmm. the the marriage and all that so people tend to think that and i I was disagreeing with that because like i know (coughs) a few women that are like she she's just she enjoys marriage like again it's a status to us Mm, right it's like a status to us so Mm. and then somehow they're just there because of that it's not Mm. really because of education or it's just of you get certain perks if you're married in, mm. in, in, in the Tamara or Nama tradition. Like, it's just a <coughs> nice thing. You are respected and it just, you can, it's something you can break with a person, your life cover, what you can hear and, and, and help so, hear. So, so the, the, do people still see marriage as a symbol of is success? It's a thing. Yeah, yeah it, it huh? is. People, people are saying, Come but, on, but, but, but it is, but they you, do it. Here's the question, Neville. Are, are you proud to be married? Uh, no, or would it not it's, would it's, it not be any different no. like Zelly and I we not married mm. but I mean uh, when I was younger okay it it was probably a little label of I don't know of stability I I, I, I don't know but if God forbid me and my fro are not together anymore and Ten years down the line, I meet somebody new again, um, because I'm not going to get married again. This is it for me. Yeah, you're not going to do it. I'm, I'm not going to get married yeah. again. Uh, Neither am I. Yeah. So, but I can find a life partner. This. That I and everything can works. spend the rest of my life with. Yes, because everything works. Yeah. Kiksus <laughs> medaris. Nah. You know, in the in the olden days, when let's say the man married the woman. Mm. The woman then took the surname of the man. Yeah. Right? So let's say you'd marry me, I'd be the woman, then mm. I would be... Basson. My surname would be Basson. Mm. Mm. But then at some stage, the woman said, no, nah, but I don't want to lose my surname. Then they did a combination. <laughs> so now, if I were the woman, I'd be whatever my first name mm. then is, Kaufman Basson. Mm. Mm. Okay. And that started already, you know, st- oh no, the, the whole split up in terms of marriage. Why should it be the husband's name anyway? Why, sh- why wouldn't the husband take the surname of the woman? Mm, I know the, what is this, and good question, because what is this guy's name? Gamane. Mm-hmm. Um, Gamane, he's married to Umbi Karwaye. And Gamane is the first man in the history of Namibia who took the surname of his wife was it a better surname than his I, I, I uh, we know. know why he took that surname because we know. he's he's Gamane Karwai. Uh, he's got another name also a surname also but Level. because, because. I don't want to blame anybody or talk or you know talk bad about anybody but you get some real crappy surnames <laughs> <laughs> Listen, what's the most funny surname you had uh, no I'm not going to uh, <laughs> that's, it's just too we're rude. not going there and it's, it's a true surname uh, it's a guy staying in Germany, and um, he he then changed his surname. It just. <laughs> but like what can you do? You came in the world from those people. Mm. Kijk, kijk, ik moet say, you know, there's n- there was no way because my wife's maiden surname uh, was uh, was Vogel. It's Vogel. It's a German. Vogel. 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 It's a German surname. And but but she and her father <coughs> never really had any relationship. Mm. Um, and obviously, my wife being colored, mm. she came from a history where, unfortunately, her father didn't accept me because 
I am black. So there was no way that I would remotely <laughs> her keep that surname mm -hmm. being with me. Mm -hmm. So there was a bad legacy. Um, uh, but that's understandable. Yeah, that's, there, that there was no way. Mm. There was no way. You say you let, <coughs> you drop that surname, that's <laughs> Jake. And, and it was not even a question between the two of us whether she will become full Vogel, Vogel, Basson or whatever. Mm -hmm. She, <coughs> she immediately relinquished the surname mm -hmm. and she became mm -hmm. Inga Basson. Yeah, and I think <coughs> and, and as years, as we uh, as we as we go and develop like Chekemas, who the who the change elke dag in the in the world van daar. I think people will start getting married because like as as if it's a business again. You a uh, guys would want a uh, uh, stable, uh, financially stable woman with what, 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 what? But but you should marry for in a stable somebody. You can't yeah, marry like somebody. Business wise, you don't even love the person. You just be like, yo, we will be a good team. I will never, as I said here, Mitch. Allow and I know I'm I'm speaking out of just pure naivety here. But as far as I can. I will not allow my daughter to marry a broke ass man. They will. Thank you, good as I'll get bring for you guys. Chicksa, thank you, do you do you guys in your tr uh, traditions also have to ask parents for hand in marriage? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You don't. And you then what happens is basically you. I mean, I think that's what I would do if <laughs> anybody. First of all, I'd shoot him in the face. Bah, with my gun. <laughs> and no, ask only the jokes. No, yeah. no, no. That's why I actually bought that big rifle. But <laughs> no, but uh, uh, as a father, especially I think as a father, you know, you want your daughter to be with a man that can look after her. Uh -huh. Isn't that that is? Yeah. And a broke, broke ass guy. No. Can't do that. But yeah. but bring you know where he's from? And look, I know. I know. I remember the day when I asked <laughs> my schoolma for the hand of her daughter. Mm. Her first response was, "Near Neville." And listen, this is exactly what she said, "Near Neville." I know you will look well after my daughter. What did she mean by that? Did she mean financially? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did she mean spiritually? No. Did she mean emotionally? Uh, no. Financially. It's financially. It's mm. judging. Yeah. I know my daughter. You is should in have good just said, head. oh, excel so buy a funeral policy so bad. Doctor sal but they man to your age come and then her camera with the man some devil. The man must up his foot and come. Papa, he playing it. He should today up his foot and take us. <laughs> Some more comments, guys, uh, before we sign off our show today. You find it among Zulus and Debeles in South Africa and Zimbabwe. This is what Trini says. Uh, Mo says, uh, Nembeles are Zulus that went to Zimbabwe. Aha. That's why then Glovis, etc. You'll find them both in Zim and South Africa. Very interesting. Tayshon said, but this Armand company should design a better banner or something. <coughs> Um, Stefanus James and Aeneas is questioning the statement uneducated women. Wow, uh, the Shonza banner looks like a Chinese restaurant. E uh, Vanessa says, <coughs> It's said that in this day and age, some people still view marriage as an achievement. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh, Joshua Dula says, You get illiterate women that are independent but not academically conscious and Educated, dependent women that are academically. Mitch, are you look? Mitch, are you looking at conscious women that know their right with feminist perspective? Mitch <coughs> uh, Explaining history is not my forte, but yes, that's true. I have family across both divides within that context. Says Trini. Interesting. Mohaus says most of the times. There is enough to cover everything, but the family members usually mismanage funds, which leads to no tombstone. Hanali uh, Kaufman Bason. Education will never equal ethics, boundaries, and more. They might be educated wise, but lack street smart vibes. Nowadays, I think it's a matter of understanding and comfortable choices, 
marriage lately or relatives are rough. Some have to settle for comfortable lives, says Estomich. Kukamur, says the fan is James Ananias. Moor my cook, coffee. Yeah, never say never, never. Uh, there are so many ways kids can force it on you. You can only instill the principles to your reason. Yes. Very yes. true, Trini. <coughs> As to me said, she meant all in one because you have dated and my fro mother knew her daughter was happy. Uh, hey, Ro Ganji. Yeah, no, I was about to speak about fish rot. Uh, that's our closing. <coughs> that's our closing story for the day. So, guys, uh, Friday, the 1st of April, right, was D Day, right, for our fish rot six, where they had the opportunity in uitspraak, right. Was geliever mm. in terms of them trying to get bail. Trying to get bail. Okay. Now, as we all know now, on this Monday, the 4th of April, is that the Fish Road 6 are still stuck in jail. Which is unfair. Because Tate Shafi, or Judge Shafi, right. may bra, such a funny guy, decided, yeah. In Gaza's voice, Jelle Blay Ned here. So you could hear a pin drop in the High Court on Friday afternoon when Judge Shafimana Uitele dismissed the bail application of six of the fish rot accused who entered the court with high hopes of a release. Uh, the accused, Jeleken Amal Dainama Khanino, Dear Alainama Khani, with the legal representatives were evidently broken and crushed. With the conclusion of Oitele's judgment, which began with so much hope as one defense lawyer remarked, referring to Oitele's opening remarks. <coughs> I start off this judgment with a quotation of Muhammad, acting judge as he then was there. He said, an accused person cannot be held in detention pending his trial as a form of anticipatory punishment. The presumption of the law is that he is innocent until he is proven until his guilt is established in court. Um, what, what Judge Uitele basically said in his judgment was that he feels that these defendants will be interfering with the ongoing investigation. Right, but wasn't there already a case where, I, I, I think it was Shangala, who had one of his personal assistance and what were trying to remove documents yes. from his home and stuff like that. And cell phones of cell phones, James they were found, Atwikulupi apparently. They were found with cell phones. Allegedly here and there. So, yo. <coughs> and, 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 and with all that evidence, it mm -hmm. seems like that paper trail to Judge Shafi made him decide that there's, there's no way that I can trust you but six. We are looking at an amount in one of the dailies that I read this morning of 361 million. May brur. Okay, what if they just give that money back? No, 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 no. Uh -uh. They kind of steal something and then just, oh, sorry, uh, 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 I didn't really mean it, just have it back, but please don't put me in jail. But what does he own the world truck here? Like yeah, that? but it should be taken back. They, they mustn't give it back. It must be taken back yeah, from them. It's not for you to, to give. decide. Uh, because it was not for you to take. In exactly. The first place. It wasn't yours in the first place. You must be no. punished for the action. So why, why, like, uh, now how many years is like the limit, like uh, the maximum that you can spend uh, uh, how time much, in How much, <laughs> if you were the judge, mm -hmm. and this corruption case of 361 million is on the table and you know that your fellow Namibians could have benefited from this in other ways. Uh, How much, if you were the judge, what, what do you think would be a, a, would, a good punishable already, sentence? Already like the first year that we found out of sentence them already 10 years each with, uh, uh, with uh, a penalty of each $10 million, all of them, a penalty. Fine. That's a drop of water in the ocean. Out of sentence, the guys this, already. If like, this would have been China, 
They would have had one court appearance, <clears throat> let's say on a Wednesday. <clears throat> they would have been executed on the Friday morning. Jay Kaufine, you must never become president yeah. of this country. God, we are coming rough. But van die God. Nee, man. Execution. This was on Spencer. If I was the president, I would show the nation that I'm looking after them. <laughs> Deal with these oaks. Maka, klaar. Kant and klaar. Finish. Off. Yeah, but Neville, why? How long is? What's the maximum that you can spend in cust, uh, custody? Uh, and not be sentenced. I, I think they should go for you know what? Years. Years. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I don't yes. know what's going on, but 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 these guys have been in jail f- for well over two years now, and um, and and what bothers me at the moment is also the case of those two uh, Damara speaking Americans mm. <laughs> who's been in jail now for more than ten years now. <laughs> We gave them a name already years back. It's Dibas and Mudagop. <laughs> Those guys have been in jail for such a long time and and the Namibian justice system especially in their case seems to be very flawed at the moment because if you can prove beyond reasonable doubt that these two guys um did allegedly kill this individual Then sentence these guys and get it over and done with. How yeah. long is this in I am totally with you on that. I've been speaking about this f- numerous times. Yeah. In terms of our legal system. Yeah. Not not sorting this stuff out in good timing. Mm. That is our issue. We mm. all know justice delayed, is justice denied, mm. all that. But um yeah, it's it's uh, what I do love about this whole case is the state prosecutor. Mm. Because um he's also mentioned that the seriousness of this case Yeah. is now being recognized by these uh, these yeah. people and if they get bailed they are going to try their very best to escape the country yeah yeah ne but i would i would i would have ik zou niet teruggekomen van zuid afrika wat mm-hmm. ik zou gaan chip het van daar mm. those guys and i think it's the ego that yeah, the ego them got them where they mm. are now ik zou gaan chip het ne ik zou gaan chip het ik zou van daar af from cape town airport i fly straight to dubai mm. My Zak is in Dubai. A ra ra da in Dubai. Mm. Okay? You guys can go to hell. Jelle wat in die tronk sit, you saw? Denk in the poll kan jou gaan kreeg. Ah, ja. Yeah. Like w- which country is it that you can't be? Uh-oh. <laughs> The Interpol there, is, there is Interpol, but there's also contract killers that can be put in place. I think For a reasonable fee, you can be taken out anywhere. <laughs> Da sê jylle Ek sal nooit iets in Kaufman Da sê jylle Ek en Mitch Is unruly Unruly Ja Nee Da hoor jylle Ons We don't even know about contract killings in Namibia We don't, we don't, we don't even Kaufi think about s- stuff like that We just spoke about this lady in Lovu Ah okay. We just yes. know the law Okay Hulle Hulle Dei ander een Rara en ook terugbring laat hulle saam sit. Oh, uh, I lost for Ricardo uit. Gaan jy, jy kan kies het. Tini sê, but is this, but is this case still about being in the interest of justice than it is about political preservation given the duration of custody? Where is the justice delayed? Justice denied principle. They coming for him again, he has nothing to laugh about. As it no Ricardo sa kantu. Um, jy kan net oporo. Uh, as Tomi sê, Some money is missing. Some money is missing. Some are overseas. It is hard to get that money. It will require resources. I bet Ricardo is laughing at his brass from Finkenstein. The money must come back. It was not theirs. And Mitch Hallam moet gaan sit. Want hulle het gesteel. Groot gesteel. Uh, Estomich sê, Judge Shafi deserves a big hug from all the double D of the world. Man of the hour. First of April will never be the same for these guys. Um, yeah. <coughs> yeah, Kofi, can you go for us the VR here? Okay, the yeah, coronavirus mm-hmm. cases. Okay. Mm-hmm. Is we've got 161 active coronavirus cases. Aha. 
Newly confirmed cases, only eight with 16 recoveries, and we've had zero deaths. So we haven't had a death for quite some time now. Mm. So that is good news. In terms of the weather, the interior today sunny and warm in the south, but hot in the west. Elsewhere, partly cloudy and warm to hot, with a few isolated thunder showers in the northeast. The coast, partly cloudy and mild to warm, with morning fog patches. The wind moderate southwesterly. Maximum temperatures for the day, Vintuk 27, Wolfers Bay 22, <coughs> and Swakopmund 21. Katima Wililu 33, with Omusia 30, Ondangwa is 31, and Oshakati also 31. On Shivarongo 29, with Riobot on 27, Marintal 29, Ketman Swap 26, and last but not least, Khubabas and Betapos. Beta post today at 27 and Hubbabas at 29. And that's your weather. Get man's a year was by and added that shows that shows the cuss relic that can. Oh, okay. And Neville, my bra, Michael Amushelelo had for N E E E F her join. Say yellow, yep. It said, the man has been a little party, what a lamage. He left power. Yeah. He left his own power. Yeah, he <laughs> left his own party. He created a party and yeah. left the party to join another party. Nee. Oh Swat. Just Swat. want to tell you that with uh, 361 million, we would have been able to build 451 houses. I thank you on that note. Werdar, Verstanje, it was not theirs to give. Okay? Mm. It's ours to take back. Straf the mana. Yeah. Mohal says Kaufi is a local <laughs> Putin. <laughs> hey, Mohal, I'm not Putin. I just I just want to see a better Namibia for all of us. Yeah. That's what I want to see. Not the, the stealing, and, and stealing. Unfortunately, fire. people who have to be uh, executed for that. Yeah. And once again, congratulations to Christine Boma. Yes. Who made sure this weekend again that uh, the name of Namibians are held high. But they came both, Re first and second. First and second. Both of them. And they, mm. uh, is, uh, I think they're in Alabama. Yeah. And they're all doing this for the big one, which they're going to run in Houston, Texas. Yes. yes. Now yes. they're going to be tested for drugs. Kuma. Yeah. Mm. Oh, don't worry. They'll be Why tested. No, they'll be fine. Why no, don't they'll they be tested. Of course they, they'll they be tested, test. but they'll they, be they fine. They will do it just, you know, most like... <coughs> mm. Again. If they can't understand, they can't just like, oh, wait, but there's something wrong. Come we know on, she's man. using. Mm. <laughs> don't go there. Why don't they go test that thing that yes. walks around with genitals? In the ladies' bathroom. Close ladies bathroom. Uncle Thomas. <laughs> Uncle Thomas. Sad. Yes. Guys, bless day. Ne? See you tomorrow. Uh, what? See Kuala you Wajimas, tomorrow. What you must. See you tomorrow. That's say. Bless day, guys. See you tomorrow.